thank you, Jesus. Lord, we thank you for wonderful things. Give it to us once again to be in your presence. Lord, I hand everything about me in your hands. Take over, Adonai. Lord, using this medium as a point of contact, reaching that heart today. Oh, Lord God, let there be a great move of your power in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. I declare the Jehovah do not may they never go back home the same way they came. Let there be a transformation in the name of the Father, Son, and of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' precious mighty name, I pray. This message we are going to hear today, topic says, the Prince Party. The Prince Party. As a Christian, love is the principal thing. The first character, false character of a believer is supposed to be love. Love and forgiveness is one of the things that I mean that makes Christianity different from other religions. Love, forgiveness. The one of the two powerful things that make Christianity different from other religions. Remember, the topic says the principal thing. When there is no vision, People, if the foundation is fault, what can house do? Someone with it, a full pan of the salt, always watch weather. There are things in life we neglect, but they are the fourth thing. A woman who needed to carry a child, the first thing is the communication with the husband. First thing as a Christian. I'm going to read Proverbs 4 and 7. It says, Proverbs chapter 4 and 7. It says, Wisdom is the principal thing. Therefore, get wisdom. And with all they are getting, get understanding. I read another proverb 19 and 8. It says, He that gets wisdom loveth his own soul. He that keepeth understanding shall find good. Okay, another proverb 16 and 16, chapter 16 and verse 16. How much is it to get wisdom than? Good and to get understanding rather than choosing sliver. Another proverb, chapter 3, I'm reading from 13. Happy is the man that findeth wisdom, and the man that getteth understanding. Yeah. Okay, another proverb. 19 and 8. Proverbs chapter 19 and 8. He that gathered wisdom loveth his own soul. Again. Again. He that gathered wisdom loveth his own soul. 
He that keepeth understanding shall find good. I read it again. Proverbs 19 and 8. He that getteth wisdom loveth his own soul. He that keepeth, he that keepeth understanding. So understanding can come and go. He that keepeth understanding shall find good. Listen, we lack one important thing that heaven introduced to us. Bible says, get these two things, wisdom and understanding. This is the real thing that we use this against us. He fight it. Okay, I read once again, Proverbs chapter 4, reading from 5. He said, get wisdom. Get understanding. Forget it not. He said, forget it not. I read once again, Proverbs chapter 4 and 5. Get wisdom. Get understanding. It's two things. Say, get them. Get wisdom. Get understanding. Forget it not. So you can even get them and still lose them. Neither declare from the word of their mouth. Hallelujah. No, last week I let us know that I'm going to speak more about love. Love means profound. You can call it caring or affection towards someone. Strong affection. Affection. A feeling of intense attraction towards someone. ATC, there are many. To say a few little. The interpretation of the law. To many, to many, to many. Law means sex. I tell you one thing. One can say happen says who is any. There's people who truly love with all their heart, genuinely with all their heart. But they never have it in mind of anything. I mean, to see their nakedness, be it a woman or a man. There are people like that. There are people who by somehow must show you love. And all your man might be, that person want me on pay. But the day you mention it, you'll be surprised to hear from that person and to tell you that my love is not that. Somebody even go ahead and say, I take you like my sister or like my brother. I believe that today is made for someone. Today is made for someone. I can bet you with my last card, my last cash, that love is not in sex. It's not in sex. It's not in sex. And I still tell you one thing, that love is not in feeling. Feeling can expire. Something can happen in one's life, and that that makes you attract you on that life may be tempered. There are people with the ego eight. There are the people with the six pack, and maybe your feeling is that six pack. Or 
to go ahead. Maybe you are feeling this that, or you are attracted to that. A condition can happen, and that life may change. That is not the law. Should I talk to somebody here today? Love is not in season. <coughs> when love is mentioned, season is not there. Rainy season. Hamata. What do they call them? Summer. Winter. Love has no condition. Am I talking to somebody here? Love is a sacrifice. Love is simple means attached for good, attached for bad, attached. There are many women and men today in our world today. The only way they will show you love is that once they notify that you have something. There are so many married today simply because this man has money already made. It's not that it's the real love. And that's why a man of 60 years can still marry a girl of 12 years or 18 years based on I'm going to have my own share. There are many men today that are hunting so many rich women simply because she's doing very well. She has money. Let me go and take my own. That person might be having whatever with you, but his mind, 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 mind. Another thing. Love is different from like. You can like something, but never love it. You can like something and never love it. One of the greatest deceptions here on this earth today one of the greatest deception in this world in this life today you see the word love 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 many have been deceived with this word love l o v e many have been deceived with the letter of this love Listen, there are many men that you appear before you as a woman and say they love you and they show you all. Love is not only in show, in appearance, it's not in words. Love is not in words, it's not in letter. Love is not in letter. There are so many men that yes, they will disappoint you today. You begin to say, What happened? How come about it? Because the very first time they came, you don't know what is in their mind. It's very, very easy for any man to say unto a woman, maybe throwing the toast. <laughs> or the M of the toast. <laughs> you know, I love you. I love you. I love you more than my mother, more than my father. I love you more than myself. I can kill myself for you. Dear me, I love you so much. If God can open my heart, you will see where you are in my heart. But all is love. All is love. And that, that process of all those words, because it melts you, it melts everything about you. 
And that process, whatsoever that man asks, you can give. I have seen or hear some men that will declare a great love over and I mean unto a woman. But immediately, I thank the Lord. Say, take that. Take that. The same man who said I love you. His words, his words will change. Are you a coward? Does it mean that you don't know yourself? Are you a baby? But that day, that day, that all the system was shaken. He made so many promises. Don't worry. And the woman might say, you know, my time is not good. No, they not. Say, don't worry. If anything happens, I will take care. I will control. Hallelujah. So, greatest deception that we face on this age. You see, love. Love. So many have lost. I mean, all their lifetime effort. Work, money, in the name of the Lord. They trust them and they give all. Maybe money or whatever, but at the end. There are some good friends. The Lord has said. And they show love in great move and now cross come. Because when love comes, cross follow. But the problem there is that the message is power if it is genuine or true love. And they can cross you and give you money. But come to them and tell them business. That's business opportunity. This and that. And with that cross of the Lord, they give you the money. Immediately you receive that money. Boom. Oh. That man will become the worst enemy. Even planning on how to kill him with his own money. Law! Law! Can cause so many pain. But I still tell you one thing. Law is powerful. Law, genuine one, is powerful. Genuine love intimidates offense. The only medicine offense needed is love. If a man or a woman is in love with their partner, the same, the same people that are in love in pattern. Great thing that cause divorce other places. If a man and a woman pattern love with each other, the same thing that cause divorce other places will happen in their midst, will happen in their life. But they will scatter it with joke. To them it's a joke. Genuine love. Genuine love. When you see people, two people, husband and wife, laughing all the time. It's not that the problem is not coming. Problem do comes. But the love. I said it sometimes ago. That the love you cannot get you in the bedroom as a husband and wife. It's simple, just like a madness that enter market. Madness that enter market. That's the word I want to read here in Proverbs 10 and in 12. It says, Hatred stayed up free. The love. Cover it all sin. Love cover it all sin. Love cover it all things. Bible say one word. Bible say you shall love God. You shall love God. Bible say you shall love. Your neighbor, 
as they are said. I ask you this question. Someone who hates himself, how can he love? Someone who hates himself, someone who hates herself, how can he love? All what you see on this edge is hurt. 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 The reason of the law, Jesus died because of the law. He showed us a great law. But do we practice it? That's not what the gem says. Say, be that they do and not a hearer because that they block it. That they block it. Head cuts, head cuts, head cuts. There's nothing that stops the move of God like it. Number one thing that stop the move of hate. Leviticus 19. I read from 17. Leviticus 19. Reading from 17. Thou shalt not hurt their brother in their heart. Thou shalt in any wise rebuke their neighbor. And not suffer sin upon him. Thou shalt not Bench, nor bear any grudge against the children of the people. But thou shalt love thy neighbor as their sake. I am the Lord. This is the great commander God. Say, you shall love thy neighbor as their sake. Learn it. There's something we fail not to study. Love is education. Brother Jerry have to right now and pass this one. Right last slide, last thing. You have passed it, is that not? The same thing happens with the law. It's a school that we need to attend. It's a school. If you want to win in this earth, love is a school. Jesus said, it is impossible to say, I love God, when you hate your brother, which you have seen. Your brother, which you have seen, and you hate him. And every day you say, I love God. God, I love you. God, I love you. He said, you are making jest of yourself. First John, first John, let us read. First John, reading from chapter 4 and 16. First John, chapter 4, reading from 16. And we have known and believed the love that God has for us. God is love. And remember, he said here, God is love. God is love. And he that dwells in love. The way in God and God in Him. So he said, Herein is our love made perfect, that we met or we may have boldness, boldness in the day of the judgment. Because as He is, let me say it again, because as He is, so are we in what? In this world. As it is, that is how we are here in this world. The question is that, am I the way he is? It is said, there is no fear in love, but perfect love casteth out fear, because fear has torment. He that fear is not made perfect in love. That is said, we love him because he first loved us. Don't you say, if a man say, I love God and hated his brother, he is a liar. For he that loveth him, not his brother, whom he have seen. 
how can he love God whom he had not seen? But what I say? And this commandment have we from him. That he who loves God. Commandment we have from him. Commandment we have from him. Commandment we have from him. And this commandment have we from him. That he who loves God, Lord his his word. His word, brother, also. The question is that do I love? Without love, Christianity is a joke. The only power to overcome offense is love. Only thing that you can defeat, use to defeat offense, is love. Love. The reason why some people don't see offense is because of love. Hallelujah. Because of the love, they did not see offense. I read once again in First John, reading from two. First John, chapter two, reading from nine, maybe nine to eleven. He that said he is the word in the light and hated his brother is a word. He said, even until I read it again. He that said, he that said, his word in the life. And then what? I hated his word. Oh, he said, sister, did he hear means every word? He said, is a walk in darkness even until now. And look at what it says. He that loveth his brother abide in what in the light. And there is no occasion of what stumbling in him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay, I read 11. But he that hated his brother is what in darkness. And walking in, what, in darkness, and knoweth not whither he goeth, because darkness has blinded his eyes. Ha! The word of God, this Bible we are talking about, chapter three, we are destroyed because we don't go on it. We don't read them. We want to change. There are some attitudes we need to wear, especially this year. Let us know where our problem is coming from. Babala will hey. It is my uncle. Hey. The astronomy in my family. Hey. There are many things that the ancestral spirit is never possible to do. We are the ones that read them. You are the one that is involved. Sometimes ago, I tell us that some register, register of the Satan, your name is not even here. <laughs> but every time they say that it is devil, it is devil, it is devil. They will say, hey, how come? I'm not the one. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Okay, we read it once again. First John chapter 3, read it from 15. Whosoever that hated his brother is a what? Modara, 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 a killer, a killer, a killer, a killer. And you know that no murderer has internal life about he. No murderer has internal life about in him. Somebody will be waiting and say, until I carry AK for seven and shoot somebody else. The Bible says because you hate your mother. Am I the one who put this word here? No, you are a mother. If you know the content of hate, what hate stands for? You've been telling God every day, God forgive me for the one I did. And because you don't know, 
We did not understand it. Listen, the only way to identify those who have the Spirit of God is the manifestation of what? Unconditional love. Unconditional love. The law they command. Do them bad, they are happy. Say for them, they will see tomorrow they see greet you. Abuse them. But there are some people today, people today, that someone somewhere tell you know who you love and who you hate. That person never paid you for once. There's someone, someone will tell you, hate this person. You hate. What? Hmm? The elders conspired themselves. The high priests conspired themselves. And they gathered together. And now engineer a war, including those whom Jesus or he, and say, Can you so? They mobilized the crowd. This is Barabbas, Barabbas, and this is Jesus. <coughs> Whom do you want that they should free? Because they already pollute their mind. Because of the high priest, the elders have polluted their mind. And their great voice shouted, Crucify Jesus! Crucify Jesus! Crucify Jesus! Then what did that Jesus do? What was his offense? Hex! Someone don't wear. It might be Africa, any place, any way. It might be any part of the whole world that told you and say, Hex! And you hate. Look at how good you are. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Listen, there are some people who might cook something from left something. You know, the treatment of some people is always right. Have you ever seen someone who come, maybe you know, face or problem, and it, it joy they say I'm at fault? They might cook something which you don't know. <coughs> Jesus had a past three years. You never protect yourself. You don't have a guy over your life. Listen, I think they want it. No power have authority to kill you. Then my plan, but if God says not your time, you will not die. You will not die. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. It's not that they will not try. There are many people today that you could have sent money to save someone, but because of the information. And maybe God will trust that money in your hand for you to do that act. Law. 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 How do I know those who have this law? Galatians. I said it some time ago. But let me still say it again. Galatians chapter 5, reading from 22. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long suffering. Say long suffering, long suffering, long suffering. <coughs> Gentleness, goodness, and faith. If you still go to 23, it still talk about meekness, tolerance against such, there is no law. And 24 says, And they that are Christ have crucified the flesh with the word, with the affliction, and loss. These are the fruit of law. Love give all and never expect anything in return. Love give all and never expect anything in return. That's some life I watch in Bible. I say, Oh Lord God, teach me how to love. There's some people I watch in Bible. I say, Lord, teach me how to love. Listen, we all know Jonathan. Jonathan, the son of King Saul, 
He meant to be the next king. It's not even the Saul supposed to fight David. Supposed to be Jonathan. Remember that the son of David, Absalom, fight his father. Yeah. Just because of the, the throne. He said, my father is taking much time. I want to take over as a king. And he began to fight with him. Fight. But Jonathan, now who's supposed to take over the kingship of Israel? And he knew it too well. And he knew too well that all the battle of David, it's not that he don't know what his father is saying. He knew too well what his father is saying. If we allow David, the throne will change. They will be overthrown. The throne will change. But because of the Lord, this man has for David. Jonathan. Jonathan said, I for fix what? The kingship. I don't have any interest. I have loved him. What is the kingship before me? I love him. If you want to take the kingship, let him take it. He's my love. The father will plan on how to give him. But in secret, he will go and reveal to David. It's one of the instruments that David escaped from the hand of the soul. Somebody who's supposed to be the king. Lord! 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 Until you understand what the word of love means. I read Proverbs 18. Proverbs 18 and 24. A man that has friend must show himself friendly. And there is a friend that seated closer than what? Than brother. That what the Jonathan was before David. Marriage supposed to be a thing of the whole honor. Marriage supposed to be the most sweetest thing. Marriage is supposed to be the because it's a channel of the law. Marriage is channel of the law. That's how it's made. The law you have before your husband and wife will still go to children. And when the children go out, they still begin and love everything they see. Or whosoever they meet on their way. Hallelujah. Amen. Marriage is supposed to be a something. That way back people look at it and say, oh God. But watch the marriage today. Marriage today is the battlefield. Who will kill each other? Who will kill each other? So maybe with the husband, because of the little whatever, possession, property they have, I want to kill him. I want to kill her. To answer landlord, landlady, to take over everything. Many things happening in marriage today. My question is that where is that false law? Where is it? Hate is one of the instruments that they will use to institute what we call the voice in marriage. Hate. Hate. If the if love can come back again to marriage today, you'll find out that it will be more than sweet. It's just like a food without salt. Get all the whole ingredients. Put them. All the I mean, ingredients in your cooking. The native magic. The best of the chicken. All. Find this all the best. Put them. But without salt. Without salt. That is what is happening in marriage today. Marriage lost the law. That is the pain of the marriage today. If we can go back, if we can go back, if we can bring the law back, there are so many places that law stand up in looking for marriages today. I said, if you only can call me back. 
if they can only call me back. Because what we do, we change them. Heads change love away. Heads drive love away. Love says, if they can move and call me back. The first time Adam saw Eve. First time. Adam valued Eve more than all the creatures. Adam see Eve even more greater than God in his life. More greater. But one mistake, one mistake, only one mistake. Where are those who are making? There are some that poor. There are some that sin. There are some that taste. There are some that write letter, love letter. There are some moments in your life that you never see, except whereby you communicate with that life. There are some moments whereby if it happens that two days, three days, no communication, you'll be so worried. But where are those? That the moment whereby you share tears. Both of you might be in bed and you're sharing tears. One or two days will have tears of love. I'm not talking about tea of joy, tea of love. But a time came whereby all those tears dry up. That no matter the what happened, you say, I make up my mind. I make up my mind. No going back. I hurt you, I hurt you with extra hatred. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Let read Genesis chapter 3. Genesis chapter 3. I read from 10. And he said, I heard their voice in the word in Gadi. And I was afraid because I was naked. And I heard myself. Let me say. And he said, Who told you that thou was naked? Have thou eaten of the tree? Well, I command thee that thou should not eat. And to have said, to have said, to have said, to have said. And the man said, The woman whom thou givest to me, the woman thou givest to be with me, she gave me of the tree and uh, did eat them. Love never blame anyone. Love never blame. Love never blame. In home today, there's something that will help you see. Either you, you are the fault. You are the fault. You are the fault. The sort of them to hold hands. Because holding hands together as a partner, you can scatter a nation. Hallelujah. Amen. You can scatter a nation. It is me. It is not you. So many men and women today have sell their marriage some of them because of money men men they sold their marriage just simply because of money as a woman i want to let us know I watched this man very well. The man Samson. Samson loved him. Why so much? Samson is ready to do everything for this wife. Samson showed Delilah great love. Samson sacrificed all. Samson abandoned his family. Samson did all because of the law of Delilah. But I tell you what happened. What happened? Samson proved that love is a sacrifice. 
It's not in letter. He proved that love is for sacrifice. He proved that love is attached. But at the end, at the end, Delilah showed it simply because of the money. They don't know that this love is for sale. It's for sale. The first thing that ever began in your life, your marriage, that I want to buy love. Send it for me. He might use the wife, or he might use the husband. Sell the love for me. I need it. I will give you everything. Just sell the love for me. And that's what happened before this woman, Delilah. The devil came before her. The gods of the prison came before her and said, And we are going to pay you this amount. If that woman said, No, I'm not going to do that. If you think they kill her, is that not dying in love? But I believe that she will not die. Samson would not allow anyone to touch her because everybody is afraid of Samson. The reason why is simple because of the longer growth of money. Longer growth of money. Greed. Greed. Let me see my heart. Let me see one gold or one diamond. I'm present at my case before that day. What is the son said before me? With the money I have, I can get you 100 million. Hallelujah. I can get as many men I need. I can get as many men I want. There are so many women today that all their money that I get money now, I can get men. And I think that it's dangerous. You can get a man who did not love you. And they can defy all the women and leave their own their own way. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Okay, let us read Judges. Judges 16. Judges chapter 16. Reading from 4. And it came to pass after that he loved a woman in what in the valley of the Shepherd, whose name was Delilah. And five says, And the Lord of the Christian came up unto her and say unto her entice him entice him and see wherein his great strength lies and by what means we may prevail against him that we may bound him and afflict him and and we will do what we will give thee every one of us eleven hundred pieces of silver. Hallelujah. Look at this woman did not say no. She did not say no. She did not argue. Immediately, look at what did she say? She said, and Delilah said to Samson, Tell me, I pray thee, I pray thee. Tell me where is their great strength light, and where which thou mightest be born to be afflicted. The huh? woman who's supposed to enjoy a great man. Samson made this woman a famous woman. Do you know what it means that this? Woman in the hand of the Samson, that some hand you have today, you don't know the value because other people you see outside, because you see some flashy car. Mm -hmm. I wish my husband had this kind of let it miss this. I wish my husband had this kind of let us out. Somehow, of them are in credit. Paying every month, every month, every month, every month, every month. This is a special warning to women. Man who talk to you as a woman. There are some women that are more bad than destruction. 
to destroy your family. But you may not know. My husband died me this. My husband died me that. My husband. My husband. My husband. But in your house, they are fat and right. They are fat every day. They are fat every day. For the reason of what they're saying, when you see a man that you love, you cherish before, you see him as a devil. Oh, this cat man. You don't know that we develop heads. We develop heads. It comes gradually, 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 until mature. It's not like a pregnancy. How much will pass? Two months will pass. Three months will pass. Four months, five months, six months, seven months, eight months, nine months will give birth to it. Hurt. Be contented with what you see around you. Be contented with what you see around you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Whatever you can afford today is still the best in your life. It's the best in your hands. It never means that you're not going to have God tomorrow. Tomorrow, God can come. Your husband might not get God for you, but your children might get God for you. Hallelujah. Am I talking to somebody here? Be contented! Listen, that's the way God made this life that we do not understand. There are so many people that come on and we drive them away for no reason. All fingers are not equal. Look at them. They are not equal. They are not equal. All fingers are not equal. All fingers are not equal. There are still some people who call them white men. But they believe them there are some people that are more fairer. They are them that are more. There are some that you see, even my color almost match almost the same with them. But they are white men. But there are some new you see, they will just their color just like a trunk. You might be contented, be contented, be contented. Hallelujah. I said not that women love very fast. Women always love very fast. And sometimes men take it for granted. Yes, sir. <coughs> Happy you are that when you see a woman who loves you without her heart. It multiplies your progress. Yes, sir. It makes your progress to be more fault. Yes. A woman who loves you without her, huh? only her needs. Oh, God in heaven, protect my husband. You don't know. There are some things that women don't do. But in their heart, they don't say it out. Do not hear it, but in their heart. Oh God, touch everything about my husband. You don't know how they feel about us when they love you. Every of your movement. If you go to work, what do you think? Hey, please, let not harm my husband. In their bed, let not harm my husband. They are meant to be loved. Women are meant to be loved. They are meant to be loved. Yeah. You don't understand this. Another name of women, every woman is love. So. Another name of, they are gold. Women are gold. They are supposed to be treated very well. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Listen, listen to me. The best of the woman is in love. If you touch her at that point, you will see the best of her. Yes, Hallelujah. Amen. Don't tell me that all the women are wicked. Uh-uh. Don't show that woman love. There are some men that are already tired. Yesterday, day before yesterday. Continue. Until you bring the best. That's the way we cook rice. That's the way we prepare rice. First time you wash it. You boil it, you still wash it. Then, then before you have the final cooking. I'm not talking to someone here. Yes, we need to change this attitude. They will use it to enter our home and rob everywhere. Rob us our blessings. Rob us our breakthroughs. Rob us everything that God has prepared before us. Any home where hate exists, presence of God cannot show. And the blessing of God cannot come in. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. You don't know this. You don't know this. That the blessing of God looks at atmosphere. It watches the environment before it enters. 
Any place they did not walk is not. He cannot enter there. Hallelujah. Who am I talking to here? That's a demonstration because love is a sacrifice. It's a work of the truth. Don't leave it for one or only one person. It's for two people. Love me, I love you back. No problem. If you love me, I love you back. Hallelujah. The katakata you hold me that when you hit me, I hit you back. Hallelujah. Listen, listen. I read Luke 23 and 34. Then said Jesus, Father, forgive them, for they do not know what they do. Listen, love is a sacrifice. How can you tell me that a man who carried cross in great pain, in great pain, he carried cross? You know what the love did to Jesus? Love, because he's searching for the love, because he wants to produce love. So don't say I'm tired. There's no any work to do concerning love that is a love. Don't say I'm tired. He carried cross and the head. You know what beat him? What were beating Jesus was head. Head. Head say I will not allow you to climb the Golgotha. No, you will not get there. Because that place is a place where the Lord makes manifest. I will not allow you to do what to get there. And the head was beating Jesus. What was beating Jesus was head. Head beat him. Head spit on him. Head organized special squad of army. Soldier. Beating Jesus. Father, forgive them. For they do not know what they are doing. One powerful message that Jesus preached. It's love. One powerful message that Jesus preached is love. One powerful message that Jesus did for us here on earth is love. Listen, Jesus is love. And he demonstrated it. He did not hide it. He showed it. He showed who he is. That was the reason of the bitterness of the enemy, devil, concerning him. Love. Love. John 3 16. Reason why he came, love. The reason Jesus came, love. We thought that he just to come and give you children, give you time, give you whatever. No, love. Because love gives men to all this. When you have love, you can have everything. Am I talking to somebody here? Yes. John 3 and 16. For God so loved the world. For God so loved the world. This was came because of the love. The reason why he came is because of the love. For God so loved the world. That he gave only begotten son. That there is something that you need to give out. In order for love to reign in your home. Who am I talking to here? That there is something you need to give out. To claim back the love. If it happened, it already disappeared. Because the reason why Jesus came is because there's no love in this earth. That's why he came. There's nothing that destroys this money like anger. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. Anger. Number one thing that destroys this money, anger. I read Isaiah 12 and 3. Isaiah 12 and 3. For the love, you can get what you want. When you find love, you find joy. <coughs> Any place you find love, you find joy. Isaiah 12 and 3. Therefore, with joy shall you draw water out of the well of salvation. It takes love. It takes only love. The only way to draw every good thing that God has done in your life is love. Without love, it cannot happen. Without love, it cannot happen. Love goes with the compassion. Not to see your weakness. Compassion. Love goes with the compassion. Pack your heart. Do I have compassion on you? 
Do I have a compassion for my husband, my wife? Have your heart. Do I have compassion? Only way you can see love is compassion. You don't know in this life. There are some people that you see, they are pleasure in your life. They never talk to you, they never see you, but you see them crying for you. They are crying for you. You don't know. There are sometimes some people will come in office for counseling by just only saying what is happening around them or before them. I'm already sharing tears. Compassion. Compassion. What do you always have in your heart? Listen, the manifestation of the miracle of Jesus is because of the compassion, the law. Yes. The Bible says that when he sees people in what they are passing through, the number one thing that happens is compassion of them. Compassion of them. Somebody who has this never delay to cry. There are some people who need little things. I'll call it emotional or whatever. Any little thing is it? Baby cry. I'm not talking about the fake one. Eh? No. <laughs> I'm talking about the genuine one. Tell us. That's some women that will deal with you, deal with you, deal with you. The first thing they will say, they will start to cry. <laughs> because the mommy will be up. Then they with the first one, they will first to cry. Hallelujah. Amen. There are some men that were by if you couple that okay, let us talk about how what happened. That is when you know that they gossip for that woman. You keep it up. I'm out communicating today. They keep record. They have all the whole record. All the whole record of what happened 10 years ago. The men have it. In their mind, have it. Just touch them, just touch them like a computer, just touch them like this. Hey, 2021, hey, 20, hey, 20, hey, 20, hey, 20, hey, 2018. So, until when we are born, they will tell all that happened. There are many of them. Compassion. I want the life of Jesus. There's the place that I see. Jesus knows that I'm going to wake up Lazarus. He you knows, I'm going to wake up Lazarus. Lord, God, he said. That the word they say, when they say the message, they say, Mary and Martha say the message to Jesus. They say, the one you love it is sick. The one you love it is sick. The Bible says, when Jesus, he knew that I'm going to rise Lazarus. I'm going to wake Lazarus. But the Bible says he went. He cried. He called. He cried. But our hearts, our hearts, in many places in the Bible, the men show you. But Jesus see them, they have compassion. You see them, they have compassion. Yes. You see the lepers, they have compassion. You see the lame, they have the compassion. You see the blind. He has compassion on them. It takes only love. Without love, you never have compassion on anyone. It takes love. It takes only love. Only love. Watch your heart. Watch your heart. How do you feel when your enemy, as you claim, is in trouble? How do you feel? Some people say, aha, aha. Our expectation. Our dream towards that person. As we, are, as we are going to occupy the position of that person. No! Look, okay, let me read. That close. Luke 7. I read in from chapter. Luke chapter 7, reading from verse 12. Maybe I might read 12 and 13. Now, when he came near to the gate of the city, behold, there was a dead man carried out, and was the son of his mother. And she was a widow, but the people of the city was with, with her. 
and the thirteen six. And when the Lord saw her, 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 he had compassion on her and said unto her, Weep not. At the end of it, to watch the end of it, you see that he raised the child. Only child of the widow. Many reasons why we, can, we do little because of the love in God. If it happen that we have enough love, we can do more. Mm -hmm. More open doors can say happen. Mm -hmm. More open doors. I read once again John 11 and 3. Therefore, his sister said unto him, saying, Lord, behold, he whom thou lovest is sick. The Bible says here, he weep. He weep. The feeling he has for people. The love he has for people. He showed it. He never pretends. Listen to me. One of the strongest weapons Jesus lived for us here on earth. As a Christian. As a believer. Is nothing but love. That's one weapon he did. He said so many words. He said, Lord, we are in me. Many words. Okay, I read Proverbs 25, reading from 21. Please, you can open that place. It's for someone here today. Proverbs 25, I read from 21. If you're there, say, I'm here. I'm here. Hallelujah. Amen. Shall we wait for you? <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Proverbs 25 and 21. He said, if your enemy be hungry, give him bread to eat. And if he be thirsty, give him water to drink. <coughs> Listen to me. I'm talking to somebody here. Poverty is not the lack of the cash. So. <coughs> Poverty is not the lack of the cash. There are people that are very, very poor. There are many things that God sees as a heaven, sees as a poverty. <coughs> when you have the attitude of unforgiveness, heaven sees you as a poor man. You may have all the whole money on earth, but you are a poor person. That's the reason to give our enemies another chance. I don't know who.